Various cameras have been deployed in space that allow scientists and researchers to study and observe various things throughout our solar system, some of which include the SOHO camera that can be found close to the sun, and various cameras on the International Space Station that points towards the Earth. NASA's HEDO viewer cameras allow them to observe the sun, which is important to understanding its current behaviour. Developed as part of the European Space Agency and NASA's HELIOVIRA project, the Solar Heliospheric Observatory allows anyone to view its entire library. Over the years, it's provided some incredible photographs of our Sun. However, some have noticed some strange anomalies in recent years, one of which has become known as the Giant Cube. I recently got sent this photograph by one of our subscribers saying that they managed to capture the mysterious cube that was caught by NASA's SOHO cameras. They said the following about the object. I'm not really someone who's interested in these topics. I love astronomy and I love looking at live cams. However, I did notice that while looking through SOHO images, I saw this mysterious cube. One thing I find interesting is the size of the object. I have no idea what it is but I thought you'd find this interesting." End quote. As with the majority of these findings, the individual is usually left confused. These objects aren't anything new, and have been picked up by these cameras for years. Depending on who you talk to will depend on the explanation you get. For example, UFO believers are of the opinion that these cubes are related to the UFO phenomena, and that every couple of weeks or so one of these giant objects is spotted. These discoveries soon get picked up by various websites, who all seem equally confused as to what the object is. Believers in the unknown have said it's strange how these objects are always seen around our sun, with one researcher saying that the cube UFOs aren't really seen anywhere else. The most common place to see them is on the SOHO cameras. However, other theorists have said that cube UFOs are nothing new, and that this shape of UFO has been witnessed by people for years. These strange photographs have only caused people to speculate about what these mysterious objects could be, with some putting forward the idea that the sun is a portal, and that these crafts come back every other week to use the sun's energy. It's important to note at this point that scientists are not impressed with these photographs, and say these have nothing to do with UFOs, and are most likely glitches or other types of camera anomalies. They point to the fact that sometimes when these images have been developed, you can get these strange shapes that appear, saying that they have nothing to do with unidentified flying objects, and are just processing errors that sometimes appear. Those that believe in UFOs though have said this explanation doesn't explain what's being seen, and that there's definitely something going on. One UFO researcher said the following, One of the problems is the size of these objects. They are easily several miles in diameter, and that immediately throws people off. But what I find interesting is how many of these alleged cubes are black in colour. It reminds me of when you view restricted places on Google Earth. Sometimes they're blacked out so the general public can't see what's going on. This is what these images remind me of. It's as if NASA have placed a black cube here so you can't see whatever was there. I think the actual discovery is hiding behind these black cubes, and that they're just placed here to stop us from seeing the real object. End quote. As mentioned, some have suggested that these giant cubes are hundreds of miles in length, and that perhaps we should stop calling it our sun, as we may be sharing it. They go on to say that for years mysterious objects have been seen in and around our sun, and with the increase of things like HD cameras and telescopes, people are able to capture them on camera a lot more easily. Those who have measured these types of objects have said that some of them are almost as big as our planet. NASA has provided an official explanation on their SOHO page, they said the following. Ever since launch there's been a number of people who've claimed to have seen flying saucers and other objects in SOHO images. Although some of these supposed pictures of UFOs can seem quite intriguing, 
They've always turned out to have quite an ordinary cause when examined by experienced SOHO scientists. Recently, we've been receiving so many questions and claims that we'd like to set the record straight. We've never seen anything that even suggests that there's UFOs out there. Most commonly, UFO claims are due to perfectly natural flaws, or artifacts in our publicly available data. Some of the things that people are seeing are planets, cosmic rays, software glitches and debris. Another NASA official said the following about these claims. The majority of these alleged UFO sightings can be easily explained. One of the things that people see is space debris that's made its way in front of their cameras. When these pieces of debris are up close, it can look like an unidentified flying object. In reality, people are just seeing a common piece of space debris. End quote. According to former NASA engineer James Oberg, he went on to say that these objects are just space dandruff floating in front of cameras. When they appear in front of cameras, they give off the effect that something much larger is there when in reality what people are seeing has a natural origin. He said the following, I've had enough experience with real spaceflight to realize that what's been seen in many videos is nothing beyond the norm, from fully mundane phenomena occurring in unearthly settings. Scientists don't seem faced by these discoveries, and have said they will likely not comment on these types of anomalies anymore. But amateur researchers are of the opinion that there's something more mysterious going on. Space is one of the last unexplored frontiers for humans, and with that comes an air of mystery. There's many of us that want to believe that we're not alone, and that there's other intelligent life forms out there. But NASA have said that UFO researchers have it all wrong, and that there's never been any realistic UFOs captured on camera. It seems though that the government may be contradicting these statements, as recently they've released interesting videos showing UFOs, and even saying comments like they've recovered off-world crafts. It would seem that the UFO debate is far from over. So what do you guys make of these cube images, and what do you think they are? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.